Oh. Huh. Fucking too good. I didn't come around. Oh, that button right there. All right, let's see. Try some stuff out. Never even heard of any of these people. Fucking too good. I didn't come around. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Uh, let me go ahead and copy some links. Here. But I'm trying to figure this out. How loud is this going to be? Very loud. Very freaking loud. Oh, I'm so sorry. That is really freaking loud. Oh. Oh. All right. Um. All right. Hey, un un unknown gamer. What's going on, man? Uh, there it is. It's actually working now on the just chatting thing right there. Awesome. I like it. What if I go... There we go. Oh, that is still really loud for you guys. I'm going to have to actually mess with my XLR. I don't I don't know what's going on here. But, all right, bear with me. Two seconds. I am going to be going to... Hey, good morning, Pete. Up. Yeah, I know it was really loud. That's that was my bad. That was my bad. I'm trying to figure out why this is not working on the editing thing. You guys are not going to that. Uh, it is what it is, I guess. One name on there, I guess that's all that matters. Over. All right, so we're gonna get into this here in a second. Yeah, I'm sorry, gamer. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. All right. Go ahead and. Mic is cutting out. Yeah. Um. Uh. Do 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 do. I think it's because, guys. I think it's because I have a filter that I added on my microphone for no reason. All right. Let me know if that's any better. I went ahead and turned down the noise gate and everything else like that. Get my shirt out of here. All right. Oh, microphone should be fine at where it's at. All right, well, I'm just going to go ahead and launch Call of the Wild. I upped the bit rate of the game. And sorry about the mess in the background. It's close to Christmas since we're kind of storing all the Christmas presents for my daughter in here. But I'm going to go ahead and launch this. And I upped the bit rate. Um, yeah, one subs is close, I really hope. But I'm trying to figure out why... This recent stuff is not working. I, I keep getting notifications that I'm gaining subs, but on here it says I am not. So I don't know what's going on with that, you guys. But we're getting into this right now. Um, I'm actually let this boot up. Should be coming up here shortly. There we go. 
But yes, I cranked up my uh, bit rate to 9,000 to go ahead and stream using that compared to, I think it was only like 6,000 before. It's better for me. All right. All right, good. I cranked down some stuff. And we're here at night. Don't ask why I'm out here at night. Don't ask why. Oh, why? This ain't the map I wanted. Okay. Well, let me go ahead and get my stuff off. Let me go ahead and get some stuff off of my character really quick. Because I think I have all night vision stuff on right now. I don't. Good. All right, we're off. We are off. Okay, good. Good. I was really hoping that that would kind of fix the microphone problem. Now, why can I not? Oh, so much better right there. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Oh, that's not what I wanted to train. Dog's going nuts. He's going nuts at the gate. Got all the Christmas presents and everything going on in here. So we actually had to go ahead and box off the office from the animals. I feel like that light's really bright. How old is your daughter? My daughter is going to, is a year and a half. So this is kind of like a pretty big Christmas. If you ask me, yep, she's a year and a half. Um, going to hopefully it should be the first one that she really remembers. So that'll be pretty cool. Getting a lot of toys. She's getting a little bit older, understanding more. And I don't know where to sleep in this. Um, do I not get that nice fancy house? Do I have to sleep out here in the barn? Nice storage area. All right. I don't know where to sleep. I have no idea. Nice. Yeah. Yep. Growing like a weed. They grow like a weed. I'm, I'm assuming it's a bed. Oh, it's right here. I walked right by. All right. So I'm going to start this 730. And where are we at? We are way down here right now. So I think I'm going to keep exploring downward. Kind of hit these lookout points and everything else like that. And then we'll just go ahead and continue on from there. Hopefully it's not too skippy. Hopefully everything is going well and it's not dropping frames or anything. I found it. I found it. It just took me a second. I didn't realize I had to be like literally standing right in between both of those beds. But I crank like I like I keep saying I cranked the bit rate up to basically max that for 1080 from what the chart says. And I'm hoping for the best here. And we're gonna go from there and see what happens and I'm more or less trying to crank my bit rate up higher. Hey, wait a second. I don't have a light on that. Or the people who miss the streams and can go ahead and go back and watch them and still watch it in a quality. I'm thinking about changing this light. I don't know if I like that or not. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's just because I'm so white. All right, cool. We're here. We're here. We're playing games. I just can't get, I just can't get my stuff comfy today. This was really rough. This was a really rushed and rough start to this uh, stream today. Uh, if you guys follow my Twitter, I've been tweeting out quite a bit lately. Quite, quite a bit, quite a bit. Been more active on that, you should say. I'm sure you guys are going to hear the pup in the background. Usually she's in here. Uh, how'd deer season go? It's actually still deer season for us right now. It's uh, the muzzleloader until the 22nd. So tomorrow's the last day of muzzleloader season for us. And then uh, 22nd ends muzzleloader season. The 23rd opens up late dough. 
with a shotgun or muzzleloader or any legal caliber in my area and for bucks and that kind of stuff it is back to bow season and we actually have pigs right here right here all right fleeing fleeing i don't blame you i'd be scared of me too so our deer season's still going we still got what eight ten days left of our deer season here in michigan we got a long season a lot of seasons long season So well, that's pretty cool. A lot, lot of deer get harvested around here. So we're exploring today. I'm gonna go out, do some exploring, see what we can find. I'm gonna try to harvest this some nice animals along the way, though. All right, where the frick is this thing? Oh, it's still pretty far this way. Ooh. Uh, yeah. Hey, what's going on, Tiger? How's it going, my friend? Indiana's still going, but I don't know if I'm going to get out it. Get to go again. I didn't get anything. Oh, man, that's a bummer, man. Yeah, yep. Yeah, uh, I got family that lives in Indiana, and I've actually been wanting to actually go out there and bow hunt. That, or I want to go to Ohio and uh, bow hunt some early season. Just because I'm pretty sure you guys... I'm not mistaken. You guys have antler restrictions. You have, uh... What is it? APR. You have APR in place in Indiana and Ohio, I believe, which is antler point restrictions, I believe. So you can only shoot four or more on one side or outside the ears or however that works. But here in Michigan, we don't actually have that. Uh, we have a combo license that grants you two buck tags and a... Oh, shoot. I think it's just two buck pack. Yeah, Tiger, I remember you, man. But I, man, I can't remember how, I'd have to look at my, look at my license. I haven't used a buck tag license this year at all. No tags, but no buck tags. Uh, we're at in Indiana. We have no restrictions. Oh, you guys don't have any restrictions. It might just be Ohio then. It might just be Ohio then. But even crossing over between, I, I don't know. I, I just want to go out of state and hunt in Indiana, Ohio. That kind of stuff is right on the border for me. And we're at in Indiana. I believe he lives on the outskirts of Fort Wayne, Indiana. Kind of out towards Aqua, Indiana type deal. If you are familiar with any of that stuff. So he's, he's close to the city, but he's still on the outskirts by a little bit. So he's got some land and it'd be just, just be fun. Get out there, you know, see family at the same time and go ahead and do some bow hunting. That'd be pretty cool. That would be fun. I, I just still can't get over this map, you guys. You guys haven't played this map? Oh, I highly recommend trying it. They really keep setting the bar for themselves as they go. First, we had Yukon Valley. Well, that wasn't really the first one, really. I mean, we went from what? We had Leighton Lake. And then the... No. And Hirschfelden at the beginning. You're at the southwest part of Indiana. Also, you're pretty... Well, you're opposite side of me from border of Indiana. But no, it went... We had Hirschfelden, Leighton Lake, and then it went... Medved. That's right, the Medved. Oh, I completely forgot about that. I feel like ever since after Fernando, they've really stepped up their maps coming out with, you know, the Yukon Valley and now this map. I mean, I feel like they really have stepped up their maps. I would just, I don't know. I'd love to see more weapons added though. I mean, they sneak them in here and there and do weapon packs and everything else like that. I wish they would just come out with something and say, hey, we're going to take a straw pole or we're going to take a live pole and everybody smit kind of between these weapons, like muzzleloader or new pistols or something like that. And just come up front saying, this is what we think we want to do. How do you guys feel about it? And go from there. And then they can make the decision or they can listen to us and go with our decision. I don't know. It makes it something kind of cool. They can interact with us a little bit more. 
I think that would be pretty nice. Pretty nice. All right, so we actually have Ram up here, huh? <laughs> cool. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, thank you, Peach. Thank you. I can't remember. It's been so long since I played anything other than this map and Yukon. Oh, Spears would be awesome. I was even thinking like that for the Hunter Classic. I don't know if you're a big fan of the Hunter Classic or not, but that is the original game that got me started on uh, YouTube, basically. And I still dabble with it here and there, but ever since the model of free-to-play went, went live for them, I just feel like everything for them went... <laughs> downhill pretty quick i don't think i don't think i could log on to that game right now and recognize maybe three or four people hosting maps like i used to and me i mean i still love the game the realism on it's good and i don't know it's just an awesome game though and i always said that even if they added blow guns spears or anything like that because of how the animals interact with the tree stands would be perfect to add spears to that game. Absolutely perfect. The animals come right below you. And I don't know if anybody's ever really watched that kind of hunting of like the cold steel spear and stuff. They throw them straight down on top of them and everything. It would be absolutely amazing. And yes, Tim Wells, that's who it was. I was trying to think of the name as I'm sitting here talking about it and that is who I'm referring to. And, you know, blow guns and... Thought I heard something. Blow guns even. And that kind of stuff would be an absolute awesome addition to both of these games. I even thought, you know, here's my... Hear, hear me out. Hear me out. All right. All right. So, imagine... Imagine this. I've been saying this for a year now even a little bit longer than a year farm simulator the hunter call of the wild the hunter classic came together and made a freaking game i'm talking food plots trail cameras a whole seasons different seasons different everything just like real life shit all coming together like you set up trail cameras you have a server that runs live or I don't know and it like freezes the animals when you go offline i just something off the wall something crazy like that would be so freaking sweet in my opinion make the food plots in your off season and then you got to change your weapons due to the seasons due to the legal hunting oh something like that'd be amazing but i don't think everybody would like it you know trapping you could add to any of these games at any time oh man Slock master. There you go. So far, you guys, I really haven't even been looking for animals. I'm not going to lie. I just been kind of chit chatting. It's been nice. We've been running into some twack. I'm going to head down to this lake. Usually, lakes are good hunting on this map. Good hunting. Yeah, I think, Peach, that'd be amazing. Just trapping and change of the seasons. That'd be. That'd be a big bonus. I mean, I could, you know, ever since I was, I remember when the Wii first came out and we're a bit, we, we used to be real big trapping into trapping, me and my father. And, um, we always talked about like playing the Wii, how you got the nunchucks. Could you imagine a trapping game with those nunchucks where you actually had to like hold the trap, open the jaw, set the pin and open. Oh my goodness. Thing would be amazing but trapping would be awesome christmas break started so we gotta start the traps yeah we I, we already set ours off for the year uh well, only only reason we do it anymore is to get rid of i i really want zebra zebras would be really fun too that's always been a bucket list of mine is to actually travel and harvest a zebra in real life with a bow but that's that's gonna have to wait a little bit longer but yeah, but finally, finally, find us right there. But no, our traps are set off for the year. Uh, the only time we actually really trap 
heavily is for coyotes and fox and that's kind of around shotgun season for us in michigan just because we are out one of us me or my father on our property are either out hunting at that almost every day and it's not super cold so we don't really have to do too much with them and we just try to get the predator numbers down on our property because there for a while they were pretty freaking high and getting a lot of pictures of coyotes and fox oh so we put a dent in them this year i think we got from what i can remember from what i've seen and dispatched and helped we got at least six there we have the models for traps though because of the missions oh really okay that'd be pretty cool they could do you know, just think about it. You could have that would that they could branch off from adding traps from predator trapping, small game trapping, and then from there they can go ahead and add other little animals, raccoons to hunt, um, water animals, muskrats, minks, otters, beaver. I mean, it would be that's just an explosion of content that they could release. I got a feeling though it's going to be turkeys that come out next on this game. That's all I'm saying. I just kind of feel like it's going to be turkeys. The Hunter Classic is getting a revamp, I'm pretty sure, of turkeys right now. And I just kind of feel like that's going to roll over into the Hunter Call of the Wild. And we should or maybe would get turkeys. That's a pretty big... That would be a pretty big addition to this because that's a lot more, lot more content. You got decoys, tents, blinds. Callers, maybe a new shotgun or two for turkeys. I don't know. Uh, alligator and Crocs would be cool. Yes. Yes. I've always said that about the Hunter Classic. Alligators, crocodiles. It would be awesome. That would be absolutely awesome. But I'm a big small game hunter. I would love raccoons, squirrels, everything like that. That's just a, that's a gold mine literally it's an explosion of content that they are literally just not putting out honestly that's my opinion okay cool we finally oh red deer god dang it not what i want oh it's a big herd though that's a big herd of red deer that's a big herd all right i'm not liking this side of the map too much i'm about to just go over there and look for some Diamond sheep. Sheep, Ibex, Ram, whatever you all want to call it. I don't know. If, if this was my baby and this was my game, I would be trying to just pump out the content for this game. It has the popularity right now. It has the player base. It has the fan base. I don't know what they're waiting for, to be honest. Really have no idea what they are waiting for a perfect time i i just i don't know i mean this this the people who are in charge of the game should be a pretty big company should have quite the staff members i think since the beavers that don't exist i'm like, like knock down your stands if they yeah i agree <laughs> i agree on that one too Beaver knocked down your stands. Well, there's no freaking beavers in the game. How can it knock down my stands? I got something coming up on me. Maybe not. But all right, I'm going to take the first shot on our first animal of the hunt. I it's, We've just been chit-chatting here for about 20 minutes. Be a decent hit. That was the level seven hard. All right, what else we got over there? All right, you're going to posture up with me there, boy. That's what you get for posturing up. That's what you get. He going to go down today. He going to go down. Going down, down, down. The ring of fire. Ah, some good coffee, you guys. I see one down right out there. All right, I think I'm going to look at this lake. Just kind of scope this out. Grab this outpost really quickly. And I think we're going to head back up into the mountains. Get out to 6.5. Um, we just got two red deer, I believe. We should have. There's one right there. 
I shot this other bowl just for kind of a score check. I don't think I have a consecutive harvest. I'm not a big red deer hunter fan. You know, I'm just, I'm here for some, some wolves, some rams, some ibex, and a, a lot of bright colored blood right there, you guys. All right, I think this was the first one. Whatever one looked bigger when I walk up and look. All right, I'm just gonna pick them up. Uh, yeah, I didn't have a consecutive harvest, and it was actually a gold. And that was a double long at 243 meters. That's not bad. Not bad. Uh, since I'm a widow, I really can't draw back a bow. There's nothing better here 20 yards away. A perfect heart shot with the bow. Yeah, I agree there. I agree there. I'm a huge bow hunter myself. That's actually what I w I've been wanting to do a video, like a vlog style video. And I got it from DD33 uh, about, you know, showing you guys kind of my hunting gear, my setup, my bow hunting setup, my shotgun setup. And you know what I mean? Just kind of like breakdowns and shoot the bow a little bit and maybe shoot some rifles or something like that. I say rifle, but it, we only can use shotgun or muzzleloader here. So notice something different. Ugh, I'm having the hiccups. All right, I don't think I'm gonna see anything, but I just wanna grab this and then we're gonna head off to the honey hole area. Right yeah, here, more red deer. So literally the only thing we've seen is red deer, some little ibex things, and a couple boar. I'm gonna head off in this direction. I'll get up and over here. We're gonna go over here, boys. Ladies and gentlemen, we're heading over there. Ah, uh, goodness. Actually, there's two right here. I ain't even going for it. I ain't even going go for it. Oh man, actually pretty warm in here. I remember the first video of yours that I watched was a piebald fox. Yeah, that was, uh, I'm pretty sure that piebald fox. I think in that same day, I have another, no, no. You got, you'll see that spot peach come up in a, uh, another called wild video. I have. I gotta still edit. I'm pretty lazy about that, but I gotta edit it still. Um, and I'll be actually around in that same area during the, that video. So stay tuned for that. I'm excited about that one. That one I had a lot of fun, a lot of freaking fun doing it. And I actually tried to do it on this map the other day, but it was a lot harder on this map than, than uh, Yukon Valley for what I did. But stay tuned for that. I got a couple ideas of things here and there to work on for this game, but more or less, I really want to focus on um, sitting down, doing these Saturday streams, and hopefully it escalates into more, and I have a lot of time off. I basically have all next week off of work for holidays, so I'm going to try to stream in the afternoon here and there, maybe a Christmas stream or something like that, because I plan on uh, bow hunting every morning. I'm going to be bow hunting every morning. Or late doe, you should say, with a gun. Because I'll be taking a gun and a bow with me, of course. But, um, hello. Oh, you, level four. Oh, don't move. Hey, stay there, stay there. Hey, 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 stay there. Hey, stay there. Come on. Stop running. No! Ah, uh, heck. So yeah, I'm gonna try to be streaming in some afternoon streams, and uh, I'm really focusing on this whole uh, streaming thing to YouTube. And I'm probably just gonna be doing, you know, highlight reels and everything else like that. But I'm gonna leave those. I'm gonna leave those two level fours right there. That'll be a good one to remember. And I'm gonna actually head up here. Yeah, we're gonna do kind of the same route we did last time, but I want to grab some tents. I'm gonna, start, I'm gonna place down some tents here. 
starting to sweat. So let's go ahead and come over here real quick. See, do I have enough storage for some tents? I hunt dove, deer, turkey, and occasionally rabbit and squirrel once. Okay. That's that's a good amount. Um, I'm a Oh, I do have a camel one on. Okay, cool. Um, I, I'm mainly I'm not a big turkey hunter. Um, a lot of my friends are though. I got a lot of friends that are diehard turkey hunters. I've killed two or three turkeys. And I just really I, I've never went back. You no, know, it was one of those things. I'm gonna try it. Got one. And I was like, ah, maybe again. I'll try it. And I tried it again. Still nothing. You know, it just didn't really appeal to me. So deer, I mostly hunt deer in small game. That's literally it. And coyotes here and there, if I have the time. I use a 308 and a 410 shotgun, a crossbow. I love, I, yep. Doesn't need to be in Hirsch. Yes, they do. I agree there. Um, I use, I got a 12 gauge slug gun. I got a 450 Bushmaster bolt action and AR for deer. Those are my two main deer guns. And then a, uh, Shoot, I don't even know what kind of muzzle loader I have. It's a traditional. Got over here. Anyways, I have a CVA Optima V2 muzzle loader. And then my bow. Then I got just your standard 410 single shot shotgun for rabbits. I mean, that's all I need. And obviously, trap my first turkey. Wow, that's awesome, man. I think my turkeys have only ever had like 8 inch. Like, that's literally it. Like, it was the first bird that walked out, called in, walked out, however the situation worked. And I put it down, and I, like I said, I just never really got that, like, oh my goodness, this is a rush. Like I do when a, a doe or a buck comes in, and I know I have a tag in my pocket for that animal. Where are you going? Are you, this, is that the only thing over here? This place is usually loaded. What the? What the heck? Okay, there's some more over there. There's a little. Okay. Sounded a lot closer than what I thought it was. But I just can't see them. Oh, they're. There's a, okay. So that herd is here. <laughs> uh, this is awkward. Okay, I found them. So they are here. The only reason I jumped to get, holy rams. Level four, level three, level four, level three. Holy cow. And these things on this map just run and run and run. Like they're still going right now. You know what? I got an idea, guys. I have got the best freaking idea ever. We're going to double back on these things. We're going to come up this hill because I want to put a tent up here anyways. We're going to come around. We're going to put down our tent up here and push them. 42 America, America, America. Hi, how is it going, my friend? I don't see a reason for no muzzleloader and call of the wild. I want to, I want to bang bang whitetail with it and yeah, yeah. I really wish we had the muzzleloader. I'm a huge muzzleloader fan, especially late season whitetail hunting with snow on the ground. Muzzleloader is just like it, it, it goes hand in hand together. Holy, look at all these ibex over here drinking. You, level three, level four. Holy cow. How the heck, how, even if I shoot this one right here, how the heck am I supposed to get to it? All right, guys, I'm not going to be pushing any farther to my north because I really don't want to spook them off, those ibex and everything off. So I'm actually going to go ahead and try to get up this mountain real quick. 
and what I can. All right, actually, real quick, put my guy to auto run. Uh, ah, hold on. Making our way up the hill. I think this is the best decision. I honestly think that this is going to be the best decision we have. Plus having a tent up on top of this hill to go ahead and bounce over here to look over this lake will be amazing. Absolutely amazing. Even, no, even... We're talking, we're sitting here talking about adding stuff to the game and what they should add and everything like that. Even a spotting scope, you know, for one of those long range scopes that you have to manually set up on the tripod and you can look farther. Yes. I understand that that would be kind of hard for a lot of people's computers to be able to spot a thousand yards and that kind of stuff. And even a little bit tricky still for. Uh, to integrate something of that long range on council, but I think it's, it'd be worth it. It'd definitely be worth it. Oh my goodness. Just jump. All right. I don't even know if I have my tent. I do. Number six. There we go. All right, now let me jump in my storage. Care about my pink one. Do -do -do. Do -do -do. I can't, I don't know why none of my notifications are working. I have no idea why. Oh my goodness. If only I could see that far. Oh, I should be able to see. Yeah, there we go. Now this is some long range shooting. Holy cow. Now that other herd should have been further down. Right there. There they are right there. How far was that? 430 it looked like. Yep. Oh my goodness. Is this a rare? That's gotta be a rare. That has to be a freaking rare. Oh, the scope glare. I'm only zeroed at 330. Oh, and he is another hundred yards farther. I'm going to close the distance. I, I got to. I'm going to try to get a little bit closer to this thing. I'm going to loop up here. I'm going to come up top here. We got good wind. We should be fine. 430 meter or yards away from him. And I don't think he should spook us running up on a freaking mountain. Uh, what map for turkeys? I'd, I'd say Leighton. They could do Leighton Lake. For sure. Yeah, I think it'd be about only Leighton Lake. That's a, Leighton Lake would be the only map that would kind of make sense. All right, 296. What can I zero at? I think we should be good. I think we should be real good right here. I don't know. I think this is a rare. I really do. Let's see. Let's take a better look. That's a big, that's a pretty big Ibex too. 274. 
I think I think I zero with three three thirty. I just, so I'm gonna have to aim a little low. All right, he's hit. Not the best. That other one should be hit. That one's gonna go down. I <laughs> eat an arrow. I wish. All right, one went down. I'm gonna have to try it. I'm gonna have to try another shot. Come on, he should go down though. Ah, oh, we messed that up big time, guys. We messed that up big time. That's quite the poke. Look at all of these. Holy crap. All right, we got the one though. The one should be a decent, decent score. We got some more Ibex over there. Them Rams never come back though. I really want to give them some time because I know they're going to come back. I, I just know it. I wonder if we, I think we probably shot low. Yeah, here they come. They're coming on back in. So level five, I'm pretty sure is max. I'm not mistaken, but while they come back in, I'm actually going to make my way towards them. We're going to do that. God, I love this 6.5. So what we're going to actually do is I'm going to try to cut them off and get off to this next mountain ridge right here. I kind of think I should have done this before. A deadfall trap would be useful. Yeah. I agree there. I mean, there's just so much they could do. So many little things, you know, it's just the limit. There is no limit when it comes to this kind of stuff and outdoor games and that type of stuff, but they kind of are restricting themselves, but it is what it is. It's up to them, not us. It's their game, not ours. All right, I mean, all right. So I don't quite know. I'm going to save that clip just in case it is a rare for a stream highlight. It looked dark. Could be a melanistic. It would have been big, but I messed up. I done goofed. I put a bad shot down range. It is what it is. You can't take it back now. They should be moved back. Yep. They're already back here. Did I spook them. I spooked them. They're right underneath me. Oh, there's another big group right here. What? I have Ram coming up behind me. Let me see if I can see them real quick. Imagine how good the recurve would be if they fixed it. I've, I have the recurve, but I've never really tried it. I tried it the first day it came out and I'm pretty sure if I remember right, I'm pretty freaking sure I shot an elk. That was probably 20 yards from me, not even. And I cut, I tried to put them in the center of my screen or something. I can't quite remember how exactly I did it, but when I shot the thing stuck them right in the nose, I had a video. I'm pretty sure I ended up putting it up in a highlight or something of me of something. I can't remember. I know kind of how to aim it, where the spot animal comes, but under them and up a bit. I'm going to have to try it out. Maybe I love the crossbow. I, that was my favorite thing that they've added to this game. Other than the 6.5, the 6.5 is an amazing caliber. The gun looks good. It shoots good. I mean, nothing, you can't ask for anything better than this. So I'm going to drop down on this tier really quick. I'm not going to, Oh man, that would have hurt. Where did these things go? Are they coming back in or did they? Oh, okay. Got decent numbers still down there. That one looks really Okay, That's a decent one. 230. I still have to go track down that other one. Gosh, dang. Oh, the Ram is coming back. 
Only him, though. Okay, so they're all back over there, drinking. Drinking. We have more coming right here. Oh. All right. Um, I'm happy I looked down before I took that shot. I think I can double up on these. I think I can. I'm going to try. Here we go. That one was a low hit. That was a low hit on this one, but they're both going to go down. And that one was a hit too. That one should go down. That one just went down right there. Stop. Come on. Okay, that was a hit. That one single lung. That one should go down. All right, there we go. Now we're cooking. Now we just gotta go find them all. And somehow get down off this rock. And then go track down that melanistic, I hope. I hope that's what that thing was. And I know there's ram back here too. I don't think we're gonna be around anymore. All right. So plans are slowly coming together, guys. We're slowly getting some good momentum moving forward on these animals. We'll go ahead and save that highlight also. Oh! I thought I was a goner right there. I thought I just yeeted off the edge. All right, so I know this one went over here. I really wish we could mark on the map multiple marks. So you can kind of ping the locations of where your animals went down at. It's kind of like a GPS or something. So I know we should have one, two, three, four, five down. Roughly five. I think we should have five. Make that maybe six. They're still over there. They're slowly still coming back. That was a solid. That should have been a solid hit. Yep, that was a good hit on him. Oh, he... I thought it was far back. Maybe it was. It kind of looked like he rotated as I shot. But that should still be a solid hit on that Ibex. things will not leave all right so now i'm just looking for the outlines of them one there one there i think i'm at what 40 percent good harvest what is this one okay this is a bigger one that's a bigger one so we know we got two right here i know another two went over here So we're gonna have to turn around and come back for those. I'm gonna go ahead and grab these ones. This is a female. Yeah, we shot her a little far back. That's okay, it's just a female. And we got this one right here. Oh, what are you? You're a silver. Not a good quick kill bonus, but it is what it is. I know I got two decent level four ones back there. Um, another solid hit right here. And this one is down right here. I, I got a feeling I'm going to miss one. I just got that feeling. What one was this? Okay, this one that was walking away. Another silver. Not bad. So then I hit the other one right up here. It looks like maybe. Yep, right up here. And I don't know where you went from here. All right, Peach. Thanks for stopping by, man. Uh, hopefully we'll see you next time. Fun talking, friend. Run talking. All right. This one should be right there, right in front of me. So then we got to turn around, go back and grab the other two. All right, cool. This is taking out a whole herd right here. And we still have another one. This was 66 quick kill bonus. It was a pretty big level four. And we did hit him a little far back. Yeah, we hit that liver. I thought, I thought he turned a little bit too much when we shot and it hit him far back. But let's run back over here. I'm pretty sure these were pretty, two pretty quick, uh, two pretty quick uh, harvest right here. 
But getting up on that mountain right there and looking right down on top of these things was a great idea. I hope, I really hope this tent pays off over here. We're going ahead and scoping that out. And I know there's another pond or something. I want to try out over there in that area. But we got some more. Should have two more right here to go ahead and pick up. Yep, right here. Actually, I believe it's the Melanistics we have to go track down also. I believe it is. So this one looks like the smaller of the two. This is a solid gold. Double long. Not bad. Not bad. Here's this one underneath lane underneath the tree. Silver. Okay, so we hit him in the spine. Yeah, stomach flesh. Yeah, we kind of ruined that thing's day. But we got to get up to this main road because I'm pretty freaking sure we just killed the Melanistics earlier on before we actually came over here and got these other rams. So let's go ahead and try to find some blood up here on this main road. These things are going nuts. Oh, there's some rams down there too. But he should be somewhere over. I'm pretty sure it was like right here he went over. If not, we're gonna have to backtrack and that's gonna take some time. It's gonna take quite a bit of time, actually. All right, so we're going to keep our eyes out. Keep our eyes peeled. Pretty sure it's going to be a medium bleed rate on this one. Just because I don't think it was a far freaking shot. Real far shot. Hey, Misty, what I miss? Um, I'm pretty sure I just got, I just got six or so level four Ibex and I believe a Melanistic one is hit i believe it's melanistic it is hit i know that and now i just gotta try to find some blood he went over here and it's been a while since the shot so it's gonna be kind of tricky we might have to backtrack on him and go from there i'm not 100 percent sure exactly where he went at all and i'm just seeing a bunch of ram tracks over here so i'm thinking this isn't his group that he was with yeah i'm gonna backtrack i know he went across this road i just don't know where he went across the road at these are all ram he's an ibex i don't think he's mixed in with this group to be honest maybe he's a little bit okay there are ibex tracks through here gosh dang all right where Okay, there's still a bunch of tracks over here too. Uh, any tips for finding rares? Luck. Literally. That's my best tip. It's all about luck. Honestly, it's, it's just luck. And that's how I found them all the time. Luck. And take extra time when you're looking. When you're scouting, when you're up in the mountain looking down on the herd or the group of animals. Go ahead and take that extra 10 seconds to double check and look at every single one before you go ahead and pull the trigger on the first one that you see. Oh, actually. Oh man, I don't know. I think I have, there should be another Ibex down. I hit two with him. Oh, I just don't remember now. This ain't good. This is not good. Here go a couple nice ones up there. A couple level fours, level threes. Goodness, I... Ugh. All right, so we're up on that mountain. When we took the first two shots. I know one I believe piled up down here, unless we found that one. Or was he farther over here? I think he was over here. All right, I'm not worried about anything else right this second. There's a bunch of, bunch of Ibex, a bunch of everything running around. I know, what are all these? These are all Ibex tracks. I think he was in this over here. Just now, oh. Uh, 
Uh, my first diamond, I believe mine was also a warthog also. Um, I believe it was the day Zafana came out at the very first lodge you come to in the field to the north or the south of that. There was a group of them running across and I was lucky enough to go ahead and get one. The biggest one out of the group and it just happened to be a diamond one. Unfortunately, I didn't record that though, but you know what? Sometimes you just done goof. All right, I think I'm just gonna have to do this the old fashioned way and kind of grid search like we're doing now. I am. Um, I know I hit two over here. I'm not seeing any of them down. And I know this one ran over the hill. All I can remember. I believe maybe like this way. I, I don't know. I don't know you guys. This seems about right right there. If that's the case, it's some place this way. When I last seen him going over this hill, he was 50 to 75. There's a bunch of Ibex tracks this way. Coming over here. Uh, please tell me we didn't just lose it. I'm not even seeing anything that's re related to the area that I seen him go. Ah, uh, I'm, I am, I'm on a mission now. <laughs> I could maybe find the replay. If, if this, if this set over here isn't one, any kind of blood, then I'm going to pull up the replay see if that has any better clues for where the shot took place yeah I think that's what I'm gonna do real quick I'm gonna go ahead and run over this way because there are some tracks going this way mostly ram it looks like I really don't want to lose this. This is my first rare on this map. The only other thing I could try to do. Yeah, I might just do that real quick. If this doesn't work coming over here. I got one more trick up my sleeve. I'm going to try. Oh, right there. This is something. This is a start. Is this him? This is him. Oh my goodness. We found him. Oh, we found him. Yeah. Hellenistic. Woo. We found him. Oh my freaking goodness. We're mounting them. We're mounting them. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'll be here all day. Oh my goodness. We found them. Finally, finally freaking found it. Whew. That took some looking. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. That took a lot of time to find. I'm going to go ahead and bounce up here to my tent. And take another peek down here. This that was a four hundred and some meter or yard shot. No ram right there. I must be over the hill. All right, I'm gonna head that way then. But we finally, finally found our first rare of the map. Oh, what a great way to start out this start out this hunt. It'd be better. I mean, if if we would have got a good kill on him, that'd have been a solid gold right there, melanistic. But it is what it is. I'm happy we finally found him though. I'm actually going to run and grab something to drink.
course. Of course, we get stuck on the one little rock. But we have a hunt club reward weekly. Flame. Thank you. Give me my money. Give me my money. Give me my money. All right, come on. Get up this freaking hill. Thank you. Goodness. Come on. Thank you. All right, cool. I did not expect that. But it happened. So I'm gonna actually gonna probably start making my way over that way. There's one right there. What the heck? There goes one ram. Oh, that was where the herd was. Female, 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 male. Uh, I probably could have taken that shot. Back in the day, I would have taken that shot. All right, I'm, I'm not, I'm not even a, I'm not even a stress. I'm not even gonna worry about it. Cause there are gonna, we're gonna have plenty of opportunities. We're going out into the plains, the plains of the mountains. And of course, I don't see a thing. All right. So. I probably should have taken that shot. Or I think about it. We have a lodge there, a lodge there. Where else? Um. I, I don't know. I want to get down here. I want to get over to this next big mountain over here. I think we're going to go check out kind of the same area we did last time. <sighs> oh my. Hey. 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 Come back here. Did he go down? That just gave me like a mini heart attack. He should be down right up there in those weeds. If not, something's wrong. Yeah, he's down right there. Holy crap. I thought I was a goner. Oh, we crushed him on that second hit. Oh, poor thing. Oh, we hit him through all three times. Oh my goodness. He just charged. Oh, I can just love, see my life flash before my eyes. Woo. Wow. That escalated really fast. All right. Well, now let's make our way over there. I, I honestly, I don't know. I didn't even hear a call. I didn't hear a track. I was just, next thing you know, he's right in front of my face running at me. Okay. Cool. 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 Actually gonna do make pull something up on my phone really quick. Um. This. All right. Let me take a peek at the map. Would be... I don't see what I am looking for. No. Ah, we're gonna go over here. We're gonna go over here. Wow, I really don't see what I'm looking for. Okay. Oh, now I do. 
Oh, okay. We're gonna go over here. Come on, way down yonder. Way down yonder in the bottom of the map. Or probably the what? Far east side of the map? Yeah. All right. Slow getting so far over here. I ain't seen a speck of a track. I think I'm going to get over here and set up another tent probably over here at this lookout point. Just because it seems like a couple lakes that I've seen a couple things saying that this lake's a pretty good lake. And then that maybe over in here is another good spot. Um, I ventured over to here a little earlier and I didn't really see too much. But I want to explore this side for today. We'll do another stream hopefully sometime this week. Doing a little bit more exploring. But so far, everything's been going rocking and rolling. We got a rare. Bunch of golds. Be awesome. Oh, right there. That's what I'm talking about. Level four. Level three. Level four. Okay, a couple level fours just hanging out. They're out sunning. That's the... Level four right there. Just like that, we're on animals, guys. That one looks pretty cool. Like I was saying before, I love the fur textures of these Ibex. Some of them, some of these Ibex, when you just look, look at their face, they just look old. They just look like such a old animal. All right, I can probably speed up a little bit before these things decide to get they don't come. He's alert. What? Oh, how are you alert? No. No, you're not alert. Why? 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 Of course, I would lay down in the bigger ones in the back. Oh. Then albino. That's an albino. 280 are you freaking kidding me I'm, I, I'm gonna take this all right we got two hit she's already down did we oh we just oh he's hit I don't know how well he's gonna go down though We just got two rares. Oh my, what are the odds? Oh, we literally just got the melanistic one. And then now we find this one. Oh my goodness. Holy crap. I like it. And we, I think we have two other level fours hit for sure. For sure hit. I just don't know how well. Uh, one second. All right, sorry, sorry, sorry. I had to take that phone call. Usually when that person... Ooh, no. I hear you. Oh, go, go, go. Aw, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Got him. It was my life or his. I had to. I had to take him out, you guys. You're terrified. I was so scared. I just had to. 
I'm just kidding. Sorry, guys. Usually that number calls me. I have to take it. Um, not like them to call me at this time. But anyways, everything's all right. But we got a, another trophy down right here. And I believe, I believe, you guys, I freaking believe this is an albino. If this is what I think it is, back to back. You, it is. It freaking is. Back to back. Oh my freaking God. It does not get any better than this. And a gold. Back to back. Melanistic and then an albino. You have got to be kidding me. You don't make that up. What are the odds? Did they buff their fur variant or something? We should have another level, two level fours down also. But you guys, you can't make that up. You honestly cannot make that up. That is freaking unbelievable. Oh, I'm so happy we came this way now. I almost didn't. Here's our other one right here. A silver. Hit it a little far back. We have another one over here to go ahead and track down, you guys. Unfreaking believable. A melanistic and then a albino ibex. Oh my goodness. I'm. I'm. I, I don't. I. I. I, 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 I don't know. That is freaking crazy. Back to back. We should have another level four. Like I keep saying, down over here. Some place. Uh, right here. Some. All right. We got some. We got some. Uh, blood. I believe this is where I killed the wolves at last time. I think. Right down in this ravine area, I think the last stream is where we got them wolves. We got lucky and they're coming out of this this little gully right here and we got lucky enough to get eyes on them. All right, where did this one go? What was this lake? Okay, I got to look out point over. Oh, that's where that, okay. That's where that really cool stuff is at. Okay, here, here we go. We're on it right here. 75 to 100. I could have sworn it went down before he went over this hill. Right there. There they go. They're off. They're off. Da -da -da. All right. What one is hit? Look for the big one. Look for a big male. Big male. I don't know if that's the one that was hit before. It's hit now, though. Hit again. I don't know if that was the one I hit. No, that was the one up there. That was him up there. Gosh dang it. All right, I put him down. Looking for the other one. Looking for the other one. He was right behind that light textured one. Did he go down? I don't know if he went down. I'm just still in awe about the whole fact of just killing two back to back rares. Literally back to back rares. I have to go find this other one. Gosh dang it. All right. Well, that just happened. We found the other one. Let me go ahead and oops, hit the wrong button there, ladies and gentlemen. I really hope that I didn't just. No, I shouldn't be. I shouldn't be recording at the same time. All right. One. There's that one. There's that one. don't know they're somewhere in this tree right here I should have two more to go ahead and pick up oh back to back you guys back to back oh doesn't get any better than that 
back to back rares. Literally one group, then we transition, made a change, and we're on another group, and it was back to back. Back to back. All right, this is this. I don't think this is this one. Where are you on the map? Um, all right, hold on. Uh, right, right here. Literally right on this mountain edge right here. Up here on this mountain, two rares. Back to back rares right there, buddy. All right, so we should be able to, this one should not be too much farther. Gosh, it gets, it goes from literally just wide open to just thick, dense, hard woods. Back to back rares though. Oh my goodness. It doesn't get any freaking better than that. You guys, unbelievable. This was definitely not a great shot at all, but he's down. All that matters. This is literally the Ibex day. Ibex day. We're out here getting ourselves some Ibex days. A bunch of level fours though. I am determined to find the level five that I'm looking for. We are determined. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe we have back to back. You guys back to back. Oh, I deserve a trophy. My seat keeps going shrinking. I keep shrinking down. We're still behind this herd. We might get some eyes on him over here, but this is going the way I don't want to go. No, oh, it's so thick over here. I don't think we'll be at, be able to get good visual. Get good eyes on it. No. Uh, I'm just going to rotate her up. Is that a row? I think that was a row deer. I'm just going to rotate kind of around this mountain like this and look down at this little pond right here. Now I'm actually going to go ahead and head towards the area where we want because we only have really 45 to an hour left. There goes that. There they are right there. We caught up to them. We didn't have, we didn't have our glasses on. I would never have seen them. All right, I'm just going to start making my way that way. Um, actually, I'm going to make my way to this lookout post. Right straight straight across from me real quick. This is about exploring, but this is more or less turned into just straight up rares. It, it's unbelievable. It's freaking awesome. Ooh, back to back. Ah, uh, we're going to have to go put those in the lodge. We're going to have to put them in the lodge. Maybe at the end, we'll put them in the lodge. And then we... And that with the highlight reel or something. Yeah, let's do that. We'll do that. Hopefully all these files saved that I've been saving. If not, I'm going to be pretty upset. I've been having some troubles with my G-Force. That's why there wasn't a highlight reel up this week of the other stream. There's nothing saved. My microphone wasn't working at any of them or anything. Why? I don't know. So that's kind of why you guys didn't see a highlight reel. Like I said, what the heck was that? You guys were going to get. From the last string. So, go ahead and just scope this out. Last time I think I was over here, there were red deer. I keep hitting my phone because I mounted my Go XLR right there in that spot to try it out. And it seems to work right there, but if I put something else up by there, smack my hand on it. Bro, deer, I'm not worried about you. I am not a fan. Not a fan. Never really been a big fan of hunting roe deer, even in the Hunter Classic and now the Hunter Call of the Wild. Kind of, I feel like I'm kind of like shooting a year old whitetail buck. Those things are still fleeing from me. All right, so I don't see anything. Nothing down at the river. Or sorry, the little baby lake. So I'm gonna go up here to this lookout. I'm gonna scope out this this next pond. I think I had wild boar over here the last time I was over here too. I think I ended. I think I harvested two red deer and a wild boar, maybe. Or am I thinking of a different pond? I don't know. I really can't remember. 
I'll tell you the truth. Alright. We are making our way around a pond. Oh. Man, I can't believe it's only 11. Is that right? It's only 11.15 and I'm ready for a nap. I am ready for a nap. Hold on, you guys. All right. Let me go ahead and... Hmm. No, no, I'm not going to go ahead and do that. No. Actually, that's how you guys can't see what I'm doing right now. I'm probably... Need to... All right. Um... Uh... I can't. No, I'll, I'm going to have to do it in, in a minute. I was actually going to go ahead and buy the lodge. I don't own everything on the game other than the one new lodge that came out. Um, so I think I'm going to have to... Actually... Um, Alright, so I'm going to upload these real quick. Come on! Let me upload these real quick. I'm uploading the pictures to my Steam account really quick. Okay, there we go. View online library. Um, store. Uh, the hunter. All right, I'm going to have to get in in a minute, you guys. That's what I kind of want to do at the end of the stream is go ahead and buy the lodge and jump in the lodge and place in our two rares and some more of our animals to end things off but we're not done yet um i want to go ahead and get a few more things done maybe get a few more tents set up in some areas where i think might hold some good ibex hunting ram hunting we haven't ran into any wolves usually through that area i see wolf all right, so we got some stuff running this way. Not bad, not bad. Where's this tower? Usually you can see the freaking things. It's huge. But I don't see it now. All right, so I'm going to close out of this. I uploaded those. Close out of that. Close out of that and call that a day. What are my friends playing? Oh, not Call of Duty. Halo. My buddies are playing Halo. Alright, so we're almost there. Right. Yeah, I think we're only going to go for like another half an hour, 45 minutes. I got a couple other videos I have to do. Uh, I'm going to be bringing back some older stuff. Probably. Maybe. Yes. No. But I need to go ahead and sit down and do two to three videos after on a game that we haven't done in a while. And I kind of just left it open ended. And that's for a time like this to go ahead and return to it. And I also have another video I have to sit down and edit. I hate freaking editing. So tedious, especially depending on the platform. Oh, goodness. I, I know when I try to do some mobile games, I'll get like a phone call or something in the middle of it. And I have to go through and physically find that exact spot in the recording and edit it out. It's just tedious, tedious, tedious. What the heck is that? Oh, okay. Ibex right there. Can I get a shot? Can I get a shot, please? Hello? You're fleeing, but you're standing still. Did they make their... No, the Rhonda Ibex. I don't think I've got one of these. I don't think I've got one. Oh, 
Oh. Hi, Rhonda Ibex. How you doing? Oh, did they just make their way down the hill after just running in circles for five minutes? No. Okay. Yeah, I haven't got one of these, I don't think. Oh! That poor thing! That thing just flung off the mountain! Oh, oh no, no, no. Oh, that's not PG-13. That thing just got tossed. It was like throwing potatoes down a staircase. Oh, oh, that poor thing. Wow. All right, well, we got the one we were actually going for. I, l I love that different fur variant of that. It was like a gray look. Oh, my goodness. That thing just got tossed off this mountain. I'm going to run up on this one. I'm going to try to run up on this one. I hear wolf. Where's this one at? Did he glitch? Where's he at? He had to have glitched. What? Okay. I, I'm not even mad. I, 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 I'm trying to figure out what's going on. But this thing, it was a gold. A 921? This thing would have been a level 5. This would have been a... How is that not a quick kill bonus? Uh, how is that not a quick kill? It flung him off the freaking mountain. That would have been a diamond. Are you freaking kidding me? You're glitched. All these things are glitched. Game's broken. Game's broke. Shut it down. Going home. I, I'm... Seriously. Oh, they're up running up there. Oh, so sneaky. So sneaky. I'm, I'm really, I'm upset. How was that not a single, how was that not quick kill bonus? hundred percent. The thing flung off the freaking mountain, literally aggressively got thrown. And you want to tell me that that was not quick kill bonus. This is not a, it did that right there. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Oh, no. You're still alive. You're still alive. Oh, oh. What? What is this going on right now? Oh, my God. Oh, what the heck? Now, that wasn't quick kill bonus, but the first one was. Holy crap. Oh, this is kid friendly stream. I promise. Kid friendly smiles. Say hi in chat, smiles, kid friendly. It's the game mechanics, not me, kid friendly. All right, let's go and grab the point. The whole reason we're up here. We should have had a freaking diamond. Oh, I'm so bummed. I am so freaking bummed. Oh my goodness. I, I'm still flabbergasted. It's literally throwing them off the side of that mountain. Ah, uh, goodness. There's always next time though, right? Next level five. That's the first level five of Ibex we've actually been able to find and take out. When I scanned it, I thought it said level three. The shot was perfect, single long. It literally, unless, unless like that one did, it was glitched. So when it slid down the hill, it hit the bottom and it was still running in place, acting like it was actually ran for longer than what it actually should have. 
I don't know. I almost didn't take that shot. I probably... Oh, it was walking away, though. He became unglitched. So I kind of had to take that shot in that situ situation. And I think I put the best shot I could have on him. Other than a spine, lung, heart. But... You know what? It is what it is. It's all right. All right. Still got 45 minutes to make something happen here. I heard some wolves in the background. Maybe we'll get a good spot up here. Okay. So I'm going to the, the, this way, I think. Maybe we'll go to that little lake. Oh, what do we got? What do we got over here? I'm not seeing much of anything. Oh, right there. Level four. Oh, more Rondas. Okay. okay. Turn 70. Those are actually in range. Can I shoot through this? No! Oh my goodness. I was about to be... Oh, I was about to be angry. It's a level four, Rhonda. Wait. There? Hold on. It's on right there. They're coming this way, though. As soon as he turns broadside, I'm taking him. As soon as this one... They're coming right for us. He's the biggest one. He is by far the biggest one right there. Okay. Hey, I just really hope I can shoot through this. Stop moving. Rage. Is that it? Oh, there's more. They are literally going to walk right, right, and right to us. I wonder if I have enough time to go pee. I got to pee. They're calm. Per good wind. I think I should be fine. Maybe not. I already hear something closer to me. Where did they go? There. Is that him right there? Oh, that's level three. Oh. Another level three. Where'd that level four go? Can't shoot through that. You can't shoot through it, just so you guys know. I don't think I hit him. Are you freaking kidding me? You cannot shoot through this? Why? Why? Why, game? You cannot shoot through that? What is the reasoning you cannot shoot through that? Can I put a 10 up here, though? All honesty. Can I put a 10 up here? You can put a 10 up here. It is amazing. You can put a 10 up here. You know, I can put a... Okay, okay. I, I got it. Got it, you guys. Don't, don't worry about it. I'm genius. I'm a genius. Put a 10 up here. Oh, I got to get rid of the... That's it. That's what I got to do. I got to get rid of the tent in order to place this down. Right? Yes. Yes. Okay. So, what I'm going to have to do is place the tent somewhere else. And then I can put down the tower tripod. Right? I should be able to. I think we're going to get another shot at this guy. Not seeing him, though. Not seeing him. Is that him? Did we hit him? I think we freaking did. I think we accidentally hit him. All right, I'll be right back.
Have you guys not been able to hear me this whole freaking time? Have I been muted? Hi, Luca. I'm so sorry, you guys. I've been muted this whole freaking time. Oh, my goodness. Well, I've been talking to myself for the past 15 minutes or so ever since I came back sitting here talking and I've been talking to myself. Wow. That's embarrassing. Wow. Okay. I guess that happens to everybody though. I guess. I don't know. But as I was saying, I'm very upset. Still, still a little butt hurt about the whole level five Rhonda. Hi. Hey, how's it going? Uh, BWH. How have you been? Going well for the hunt. I just realized that I've been muted for the past 20 minutes. Talking to myself. Had a few other people say hi, and I've just completely been muted. Feel kinda, kinda foolish right now. But it's going good. It's going good. Got some back-to-back -back rares. Missed out on a diamond, which was a bummer. Uh, but it is what it is. And we're just up here grabbing some lookout points. Oh, I can't believe I was talking to myself. Goodness gracious. I just can't believe that. All right, we're here. What do we got? What do we got around here? Not sure why these Ibex are fleeing, but nothing else is. Oh, they're walking right the frick at me. Maybe they're not. Okay. There's a road here. What do we have over there? It happens. Yeah. It's, it sucks though. <laughs> I'm sitting here looking. I didn't see my uh, audio going up on my uh, on the mixer. And I was just like, wait a second. I looked over and I'm muted on my uh, XLR. Uh, you're on Parquet. Just got my first albino. Nice. Nice. I really, I didn't. I didn't give that map enough time, I don't think. I kind of, uh... I, I'm dead. <gasps> oh my goodness. That was very foolish. But congratulations on your albino. I got back-to-back, -back, uh... Balanistic Ibex and a... Uh... Albino Ibex this hunt. Literally back-to-back. -back, one herd after another. So that was pretty cool. Um, I missed out on a diamond because of the game. Pretty sure because of the game, because I shot him. He launched off the mountain. And I think it kind of glitched him to be running in place. Because I, I, then I killed, uh, shot another one right after it. He slid down the mountain, but while he was sliding, he was actually running. And it said that it wasn't quick kill bonus. So I don't know. I don't know. Things happen. Um, Okay. Thank you. Come again. And that one's glitched again. That sucks. Yeah, it was a bummer. But you know what? It is what it is. You know, I I understand that this map is pretty buggy. So, it's bound to happen. See, like right here. Now, now they're just going to stand there and do that. I don't know. You know, there's... I mean, he's going to take off. He's hit. I don't know. But this one's still... Look, he's going in and out. So now I'm literally sitting here trying to time my shot to hit these things. We got him. And I'm out of ammo though. All right. I think I'm going to actually came in just at the tail end of the stream, my friend. Um, if I can find this, was he not always oh, way down here? That no. What the heck? Oh, rabbit. I haven't seen one of them all day either. Like, wh where did he... G this? Is, I don't think this is him. Okay, yes, yeah, so this was him who was glitching in and out. Where did this other one go? I've killed two diamonds and two... 
Wow, that's awesome, dude. I literally, I literally just got the two rares today. I haven't killed any diamonds on this map at all. As you can tell, look at my luck. This thing literally, they're just disappearing. Why? I have no idea. Like, where did he go? I just, I, I don't know. Literally. He's probably halfway across the map by now. There's one over here. What one was this? Was this the one I hit right here on run? Oh, it was running. So this one didn't go far at all. Okay. I'm still missing one. It's because you show me where this one is. It doesn't make up for it. They'll be back. Diamonds are everywhere. Yeah, I've been seeing quite a few potentials. But. I just. I just been on a mission. I'm trying to get the whole map explored. And trying to find some. Little. Nice little cubbies to hunt them in. And everything else like that. I've heard that this lake over here is a pretty decent lake. So I'm going to do a little walk around of it real quick. And I'm probably going to be ending the stream for this morning. I've already been going for over two hours. But this was the whole, the whole point of this was to get basically over here and to explore this region right now. And I'd say we've done a pretty great job of doing it. We found some good animals. We got, you set up another tent. Got two tents set up today. One up, one up here. One, one right over here. But that's just because I, that's where I found the Rhonda Ibex at right there. They're all coming right to me. And I was just like, screw it. Let's put a tent up. Try it out another day. If it don't work, we'll pull it down. It's just a tent. But I wanted to take a peek over here. But all, so far, all I've been seeing around here are those Rondas that ran at me. We had Red Stag and a couple of Road Deer, which I'm not too interested in hunting at this time on this map. So, not looking too good. I don't know if maybe I'm on the wrong time or what. Oh, we got Wild Boar right here, too. Still, doesn't make it any better for me. Yeah, it looks like this might be kind of it. Can't believe there's no... There's a lodge over here. Another lookout right there. I don't know. Where... Top right lake is loaded with red deer everywhere. Need zone. I have that lake is red deer all the way around it. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking. I'm getting some rabbit stuff. Just not. I'm, I'm not, that's not what I'm looking for here. If I wanted to get red deer, I'd freaking go to Hirschfeld and where I know where I can get them. I think we're going to go ahead and get out of here. Get out of this spot. I'm up. Before I jump off, I'm going to go ahead and jump over here and uh, glass this real quick. Let's take a quick peek. Um, just gonna take a little quick look. All right, here we go. Peek our, peek our head over this little hill, this little mountain edge. Already been lighting them up from up here earlier today. So oh, I can only look so far until it won't render. Like I said, that, that's something. Nope. So then we just go ahead and run down this edge. Like I said, I I started off right here and we at, just crushed them up here. This is where we shot the melanistic to start things off for the day. But it is pretty far across that river or this little pond. So that's the only thing that kind of stinks is we really don't have that right there. There we go. Okay, level three, level three, zero level four. Come on, give me you. Oh, I can't hit them. I can't get them. All right, so they're pretty far. That was, they're coming across though. So we can make our way across. 
Um, we got bedding up there, resting. Okay, that's a good one to learn. Um, I know they're drinking and eating in ram bed earlier on down there also. Ooh, there's some more Ibex down here. To say these tracks are new, these weren't here earlier. I can tell you that right now because I was up here throwing shots downrange. Hopefully that's not... Hopefully he's not up here with me. Is that him right there? That's him right there. All right. So, go ahead and try to spot something else. That's them again. And I'm just looking for that one just absolute giant. End things off. If not, I really don't want to be blasting up the zone again. Like I said, this is one of my favorite starting points to go ahead and start hunting at. There's something. I thought he was right here below me. Is that him running? Oh, that's them running over there. Yeah. They're out of here. But I do know, too, there's some other zones over literally right on the other side of this little hill. The possibility for them to be over here also. So that's a nice little spot up here. One of my, this is probably my favorite tent location that I've found so far. I got another one, but it kind of has a little curveball thrown in with it. I ain't going to show you that right now. You can go back in the previous, uh, previous or rewatch the stream. I, I show you what I have set up, but it'll be in a video. Something little, little tip and trick, like cool thing that I learned you can do. Because I think it's cool. But I think I'm going to have to end it right there, you guys. This has been a very productive stream, I would say. Two rares, possible diamond. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Back to back rares. If they were back to back, I wouldn't be so ooh and ah, but they were literally back to back. We got one right here. We literally got him right here. We came over the mountain right here and bang right here. Another one. Literally, as soon as we come over the mountain, we spotted another rare. moving in from behind level three looks like the biggest one's a level three level four 250 out at 250 what do I zero at I don't zero anywhere close to that but we have ram coming up from behind us too not bad nice little spot eh nice little spot eh Oh, that's why they're bouncing around. My wind's blowing right at them. Not bad. Not bad. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. All right, guys. So I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. Uh, thank you for everybody who stopped by. If you're watching this afterwards, sorry you missed it. Usually usually around 10 o'clock in the morning, Easter Standard Time, 10 a.m. I try to do a live stream on Saturdays. Um, expect more live streams throughout this week. Uh, with it being holiday, I don't work as many days this week at all. So I'm going to try to stream some more and have some more fun with you guys. Uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed If you're new and watching, don't forget to subscribe. If you're watching this after fact, please hit the like button. It really does help me out a lot. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. And don't forget, follow me on Twitter. Wild Willie OD stands for outdoors on Twitter. That's where I'm getting more involved with. Uh, that's where I share whenever I'm going live or anything else like that. So I really hope you guys did enjoy. So guys i appreciate it thanks for stopping by and talking it was awesome i'll see you guys on the next stream or the next video stay tuned probably gonna be more